a lot of people think of vultures as dirty animals associated with death and dying, but in reality, vultures are an extremely crucial part of nature's cleanup crew, and they help keep us clean as well as themselves clean in the process. Hi, my name is Victoria Kurtz. I am a park naturalist here at Meadowside Nature Center, as well as the lead raptor trainer. Here, I train five birds of prey in our raptor program. Gillis is a black vulture, which is one of only two types of vultures we have in the United States. Uh, Gillis was found as a baby in a barn. For the winter, the farmer closed up the barn, locking her inside and away from her parents. About a week later, that farmer heard her cries um, and found her in her nest, really emaciated and dehydrated. So they took her to a rehabilitation center where they raised her from a chick um, to potentially be released back into the wild. Because she was taken care of uh, from such a young age by humans, she has now learned that she's a human being, which is called imprinting, and that is why she's not able to be released back into the wild. So Gillis and other vultures are an incredibly crucial part of nature's cleanup crew. So their stomach acid has a pH of less than one. Uh, in comparison, human stomachs have a pH of about two to three. So theirs is a much more acidic than ours. And so that's why they're able to digest all of these yucky, nasty things and still come out clean in the process. Uh, they help keep diseases like anthrax and rabies from running rampant in the wild because their stomachs can actually digest those bacteria and those diseases and kill them so that they don't spread throughout uh, the ecosystem. Next time you see a vulture out in the wild, maybe thank them for helping us clean the environment.